Today let us learn to shape our crepe paper into morning glories and also we will learn to make a rectangle flower pot. Tools required for our flower, colorful crepe papers, stigma, thread, metal wires, scissor, green tape, glue, cutter and plier. First, fold up the crepe paper lengthwise. Now cut out the folded strips. After that, set and cut out the desired petal width from the strips. Here I have decided my petal width. Unfold the strip and apply glue to one end of it like this. Here the folded end will be the base of our flower. Now roll up the strip like this and push it into the glued end pocket and press firmly to fix it. Repeating the same process again to make more flowers. Just be little careful while fitting in the unglued end into the glued end pocket. Now fold up the stigma and tie it up with the metal wire. Put this inside the rolled petal like this and tie it to the metal wire. Shaping our morning glory, push out the petal base from inside like this to form a cup shape. To create frills at the petal end, stretch out the edge of the petals like this as you are seeing it here. Once done, just run your fingers between the two edges to make the frills more heavy and attractive. Now wrap the base of your flower with the green tape tightly. Shaping another morning glory. In my previous tutorial, I have prepared the stigma, but here I am using ready made stigmas. While pushing out the base of your petal from inside, try not to disturb the stigma. That is the only thing you have to care while shaping your morning glory. In the similar way, you can make your own flower bunch. And this step you are all familiar with. See, I have made mine. Moving on to the leaves, cut out a thin folded strip from the green colored crepe paper. As we are making here two leaves. Now cut through the folded line again, sharpen the leaf edges, now stick the metal wire to the leaf base to give it extra strength. This metal wire act like a backbone for our leaf. Making the second leaf. For saving time, I have already made some set of leaves for this project. See, so real, isn't it? <laughs> Next is our flower pot tutorial session. For this you need a rectangle cardboard box of any length you wish. 
Cut out one side of your box and place some thermocol pieces at the base for strengthening the base of your pot. Here I have used two layers of thermocol and I think that's enough. Now cover the box with a colorful chart paper. and fill up the box with some soil. Once finished, do little ornament ornamentation if needed using colorful pebbles like I did. Now adding life to our flower pot, first plant the leaves then the flowers. Anyways, there are no rules. And here is a wonderful showpiece item to energize your room. No worries of watering, caring and waiting to see the fully bloomed flowers. Thanks for watching.